Hello, my name is Melissa. I'm with the Top Drawer RVA located in Richmond, Virginia. Today, I'm gonna to teach you how to do easy stripes on a Mad Hatter serpentine dresser. This is a custom piece of furniture. The client wanted a beautiful ombre in deep blues, golds, and navy. Colors used on this project, caviar, fluff, Bunker Hill blue, blueberry, aubergine, and palmetto. Prepare your piece properly for painting, cleaning, and scuffing the surface. Then choose the areas where you're going to apply your fluff for your stripes. I applied my white fluff on the drawer fronts, the top, and the sides of the piece. I started with my Bunker Hill Blue, moved into Aubergine, then Palmetto, and did an ombre blend on the top, the sides, and the front of the piece. Keep separate paintbrushes handy and use a mister filled with water to blend your colors seamlessly. I use blue painter's tape to tape off the stripes on the front of the dresser. This is where I will be applying my black caviar over top of the white fluff. After applying your black caviar on top of your stripes and your diamonds, wait for it to dry before removing your blue painter's tape. Using Mod Podge and a bit of satin sealer, I can apply with a brush where I'd like to apply my gold leaf. The gold leaf will highlight the stripes and move around the dresser, providing a barrier between the colors and the stripes. After your gold leaf has dried, use a clean, dry paintbrush to remove any excess material. You've now finished your Mad Hatter design. You can use polyacrylic, gator hide, or wax to seal your piece. Using Dixie Belle's copper paint, I added tiny little cheetah prints and some new knobs. I've now finished my beautiful Mad Hatter design. For a more detailed list of products to use and the design of this dresser, please see my blog at thetopdrawerrva.com.